Welcome back to Good Day. Now, once in a while, we need to class things up around <laughs> here with maybe a little opera. Yes, that's right. Toledo Opera resident artist Brendan Boyle and Stephen Naylor join us with Executive Director Suzanne Rorick with a choral celebration, although it sounds much classier in Italian, yeah. doesn't it? <laughs> who wants to say it in Italian? Yes, who Celebrazione del coro. Someone who sings Italian, that's Beautiful. what it is. Beautiful. So it's a celebration, of, of course, and, you know, it's a big, big chorus concert. Mm -hmm. And we are so, the, the chorus for the opera is really the backbone of our opera company because every opera has a chorus in it, or most do. Mm -hmm. This is a chance for us to do the very biggest pieces um, with a big chorus. It's the biggest chorus we've ever had. There'll be 75 voices, wow. 135 people all together, including the orchestra. TSO will be playing with us. Mm -hmm. So it's just a very full Valentine theater full of musicians, mm -hmm. highly Wonderful. talented people. <laughs> of course. Yes. How, wow. how long have you all been performing? <laughs> With Toledo, we've been here since uh, September, Okay. Mm -hmm. last September, so we've been doing stuff around at schools, around town, uh, up to Michigan and all that for the last, what is it, five months mm -hmm. or so? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, one. So we, each year we bring in a new cohort of um, resident artists who are with us at least a year and during that time we they can sing with us in the big productions and then they help with our outreach programs which involves school programming and other things it's wonderful yeah yes yeah, Suzanne talk about that a little bit just the outreach <coughs> of uh, uh, going into these schools and introducing some of these kids to opera so we have we have several levels we have a preschool program we run uh, along with Head Start and the resident artists are not involved with that but then we go to the elementary schools, and that is what we call Opera on Wheels. And so they'll go into the schools, and this year they're doing the Pirates of Penzance. Mm -hmm. mm, wonderful. And it's fun, <laughs> and mm -hmm. we've been doing this for a long time. Um, since longer than, I've been with the Opera 20 years, I think we've been doing this for 30 years, some sort, each year a different opera into the schools. And we see 20,000 school kids. And wow. then this big new um, um, outreach with the preschool. We're very pleased to That's work with wonderful. Hope and John Jones's group with Hope Toledo, mm -hmm. reaching as many preschool kids and um, social emotional skills mm. that we teach through opera. How about that? You know, you don't think about the different ways to reach children. Mm -hmm. Music it can absolutely be one of those ways. Yeah, right? some of the teachers, the preschool teachers, would tell us that they hadn't heard that child say one word the whole year until they were led by our teaching artist, who is Christina Farrell, to say, to, they have to say their name in my voice. And all they have to say is my voice. For some of the children, they finally felt warmed up to it. And so we'll come back and talk about that. Yes, yeah, what a like wonderful that. program. I like that a lot. Uh, you know, the, so the performances, when are, when are they this weekend? Yeah, um, Friday at 7.30, mm -hmm. and then Saturday matinee at 2 o'clock okay. at the Valentine. At the What'd she say? Sunday. 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 What did I say? Saturday. Saturday. <laughs> Sunday at two. Sunday no, Saturday. Saturday we'll not be doing this. Okay, okay. Friday, Friday and, and Sunday. Sunday. Yeah, so yes. a lot of artists uh, indeed. So Stephen, I want to bring you into this. And I have to because you spell your name correctly with the D. That's, <laughs> yeah. that's, that's number one, just to let you guys know this. Uh, so uh, what, what piece are you guys going to be performing for us today? This morning we'll be performing uh, Ne Sun Dorma, which is from Puccini's opera Turandot. And uh, this is one of the most famous arias yeah. in all of the opera literature. Mm -hmm. You'll recognize it. We'll recognize from it. You will. Yes. Sure. Yeah. yes. And so what can people expect then when they come out Friday or Sunday? Is it going to be sort of a songs strung together from, from different yes. operas? Yes. It'll be a, a, a two-hour concert with mm -hmm. an intermission. Oh, wonderful. And it will be uh, Kevin Bilsma is really the highlight of this mm -hmm. in that he is our head of music preparation course master. He'll be mm -hmm. conducting. <clears throat> the symphony and the entire chorus. Mm -hmm. So you'll get to hear it's a big job. <laughs> lots of beautiful music and I think it'll be kind of emotional too because we have when you hear this you'll see what it's really like. Okay. Well, awesome. Big opera pieces. Yes. Let's hear it. Take it away. Alrighty.
Thank you. How does he do that at 9.36 in the morning, right? It's a lot easier later. There's a point of that the audience sings along. Hums along. You'll see. Wonderful. That is the shortened version, too. The real one is about twice as long. Okay. So come on out again Friday, Sunday, Valentine Theater, right? Enjoy, folks. Thank you so much for coming today. Of course. Thanks, y'all. Take care. We'll be back with more Good Day after this. Stay with us.